few years ago, I was visiting my dad in Florida. He had retired to Florida, as parents love to do. And uh, I was gonna visit him, and we were gonna hang out and do some fun stuff. And I was also on deadline, so I was gonna work in the morning, and we would go out, go to lunch, and go do Florida things in the afternoon. So I'm clicking along in my book, writing my pages every day, and the second day I was there, I was supposed to write a sex scene. And I, I really, gave it some serious effort, but I discovered I could not do it. I simply sat there immobilized for at least half an hour and thought, this is ridiculous, but I, I couldn't do it. So I skipped it and then could, I kept going. And a couple days later, I was in a hotel, I had to fly to New York. And in my hotel room, was able to write it with no problem. So apparently room service is not an issue, it's parents. Another place, you know, just a word to the wise, those of you planning a writing career, especially in romance, uh, do not write sex scenes on the airplane. Inevitably, there is a small child, so you have to angle. And I don't have one of those screen protectors, and so I was sort of trying to keep my screen down, so, but then I can't see. And the guy next to me just gave up all pretense of his novel or whatever he was doing. And it's just like, really, I just, and I know, well, I have no idea what he's thinking. I could pretend I know what he's thinking. None of it is good. None of it is, you know, oh, what a loving community-based person this is. No, none of it is that. None of it is about how kind I am to pets and small children. So I don't do that anymore. And uh, then I got this weird thing that had it's called an Alva Smart. It's only a word processor because it only had this little tiny screen. No one could read, not even me. And then I could write what I needed to on the plane, but but I couldn't do email. So now I've got, so no, I just skip that part and move ahead. If I'm working on the road, I will not be writing sex on an airplane ever again. It was horrible.